In this video, the PCB of the common emitter amplifier is designed. It is recommended to watch the video of design and analysis of the common emitter amplifier in Proteuse. After designing and simulating the circuit, you can also design its the PCB. Replace the power supply and signal with the pin header. Choose a suitable name for the elements. Rename resistor R3 to RB underscore up. Also check the package of element. RES4D package is suitable for resistors. Make sure the element is not excluded from the PCB. Let's choose another package for capacitors. From this page you can go to the packages library. Find the package for the electrolytic capacitor with a distance of 2 mm between its pins. Select this package for other capacitors too, just copy and paste the package name. Choose a suitable name for the capacitors.
Use this icon to enter the PCB design environment. The PCB design environment is similar to the schematic design environment. You have entered the PCB environment with Netlist. So you will have special facilities. Select the mode component to see the package list of circuit elements. Let's, first examine the package of elements. Select the package and click on the design environment. Right click on the package, and select 3D mode of the package. Repeat the same process for the other elements to make sure the package is suitable. For start PCB design, first determine the shape and size of the board in the layer of the board edge. Consider a square board for now, its size can be edited later. You can use auto placer, but for now we do the placement manually. We try to follow the schematic pattern of the circuit. We start with the connectors. You can rotate the package. Just right click on the package. You can adjust the snap for better adjustment. In the next step, we install the input and output capacitors close to their connections. Now insert the transistor. Emitter capacitor. Now insert the resistors. Place the emitter resistor close to the emitter pin of the transistor. Place the collector resistor close to the collector pin of the transistor. Observe the law of distance between the elements. Also, the elements should be some distance from the edge of the board. It is easier to place the base resistors horizontally. For this simple circuit, we use auto router. Before that, we change some default rules. Auto router should only be done at the bottom layer, for both signal and power. Start the auto router by accepting all the defaults. You can adjust the dimensions of the board.
you can see the 3D view of the PCB. Or see the footprint of the design. Let's add a zone to the bottom layer. First select a mode from the zone mode and select the bottom layer. Specify the zone area. You can make a print of the 3D design. You can print any of the layers. Print the bottom layer. Print the top layer. Or, for example, the location of the drilling hole. Thanks for watching. If you are interested in the topics of this channel, do not forget to subscribe.